must comply with Albion. <sighs> Terribly sorry, everyone, but one of your teammates has been kidnapped. What the fuck? Saz has got to be behind this. That was way too clever for Albion acting on their own. The question's why. Well, they're being tortured for information about Malik, of course. I thought that was obvious when we saw that meeting where Emma Child said, and I'm paraphrasing, kidnap someone and torture them for information about Malik. Fuck. We have to find Malik. Bags, there's got to be some way to get him a signal. Sure. I've marked a location for you. In his eagerness to leave it. Your comrade is now taking an Albion mandated timeout. You're up. Finally, some action. They won't be arresting me, bruv. You watch. Manic safe house is somewhere around here, but it will be well hidden. Maybe have a look for a slightly off color brick or an inconspicuous lever.
Mm. That lever does look a bit dodgy, doesn't it? little help, yeah? Right. It seems Malik's made some upgrades to security. And since he's both a security expert and a paranoid lunatic, I don't know if you can handle this one. Go and check that out. Well, I can. Haha. <laughs> Did you like that? With the drone? Pretty good, right? Bagley, you're proper nang. Thank you. Look, if we know anything about Malik, it's that he thinks he's much cleverer than he is. Which means as soon as I start, some drones or something are going to come after me. So just watch my back, all right? On it. Ha! Drone base. I knew it. Oh, come on, Malik. Make it hard, at least. All that big talk and security drones is all you've got, you hack. Oh, I'm Malik, and I think I can analyse Sir's dossiers faster than Bagley, but my idea of heavy security is automated proxy jumping. Oh, all right, you ready? On it. Lovely jubbly. Really, Malik? Do you really think I'd be fooled by this thing? Whatever it is, I'm sure it'll work out soon. this time.
them off me this time. script over here and voila! No, no, that did not work at all. Shit. drones off me. Let's try this again. Aha! You just thought I'd get obsessed with the brilliant little details and miss the larger structure, didn't you, Malik? That's actually pretty clever, but not cleverer than me. using the same cyber he used earlier. Yeah. Set to repeat every 15 seconds. Good job, everybody. Now we just have to convince Malik to help us get our friend back. Fuck yeah. And thank you. I know this is getting scary, but you're all brave as fuck. I'm proud to call you my friends. encrypted source. That's gotta be Malik. Put him on. You had better have a very good reason for threatening me or this conversation will be very short. Emma Child took one of ours. They're probably chatting about you right now. How much you want to let them talk? I see. As it happens, I've been keeping tabs on Emma. But I have a condition. The Semtex is still missing and if I have any hope of recovering it, I need you to take Emma alive. Fine, whatever. Right then. SIRS uses construction sites to interrogate short-term arrests. They're isolated, and it's easy to hide bodies. And my sources tell me Emma just turned up at one. Yeah, yeah, get to the point. If your operative hasn't turned already, that's probably where she'll have her. 
on it. The longer your operative is in captivity, the longer Emma has to work on her. Find your friend before they talk and capture Emma. Good luck. How are you? That's good. Let's go. I'm on my way. site where Malik thinks Emma Child is holding our operative, which checks out. Security is tighter than a rubber glove and a bowling ball. Right. Got it. I have a call from... Strange? This isn't what... Stop! You fucking idiots! Who the fuck are you? Emma Child, director of SIRS Counterterrorism. You are making a terrible error here. You cannot... Get off my voice! Panel. Apologies, everyone. Took a moment to work out how they hacked us. It's okay, Bagley. On the plus side, it seems Malik's lead was good. It's likely she'll keep her operative close to users' leverage. You should find her wherever you find child.
I could have left a fucking bomb in there. Do you want to know why I didn't? Because you're stupid. Because we have something in common. Richard Malik stabbed both of us in the back. Watch. Albion's new policing contract has promised. Everything's set your end. Oh, it will be. But first you're going to tell me what this is really about. All right. I'm infiltrating a terrorist group called DedSec. I'm setting up a meeting with them, and your men will capture me before DedSec arrives. So it has to look real. They can't know it's a setup. <sighs> you are a piece of work, Richard. What the hell are you getting out of this? Dead terrorists. I can't prove it yet, but I think Malik was involved in the bombings and the cover-up. What's more, I think he and his conspirators are planning to do it again. He said you were doing that. He would. It's basic tradecraft. Want to sell a lie, weave it into the truth. So we should just trust you instead. I had something more transactional in mind. I have your operative. Help me kill Malik, and you get them back. That door will unlock in 30 seconds. Impossible to say for sure, but it does look that way. We do know for sure that he's trying to set us up for the next attack. You know how I feel, but this is risky. It has to be your call. He has one of ours, and he wants us dead. Whether he is zero day or not doesn't matter. He's a threat we have to put down. Okay, how do we do this? If you're seriously asking how to kill Malik, I have ideas. A lot of ideas. I want to keep it simple. Let's just get him in the open and... Yes, that would work, but it's not very much fun. But you want to poison him, at least. We haven't poisoned anybody yet. Bagley, be quiet. Let's just shoot him. Noted. I'll contact Child and tell a dead sec has agreed to help. 